Hello. Are you reading? guys now before I show you what's happening I just want to say that that groundhog has about four weeks to put things right or we're gonna have words <laughs> and for those of you that don't know the groundhog said that we weren't gonna get six more weeks of winter and it's only about four more weeks until the official first day of spring so Groundhog, you got four weeks because this is what we woke up to this morning. Yep, you guessed it, more snow. And it's still coming down pretty good. Now, I'm not one to complain about the snow too much, but I'm really getting to where I just want to get going with our veggie garden. I'm just itching to get my hands in the dirt, get planting our seeds and get going. But I guess the Lord's teaching us patience because those of you that know me know I'm not very good at being patient. <laughs> but sometimes you ain't got a choice. But this is another reason why Will and I are planning to build a greenhouse because that way we'd be able to grow year round and when the weather's being crazy like this going up and down from 60 to 60 degree weather back to snow it won't matter but we'll get it we'll get there and we we'll hope y'all are gonna stay warm today it's crazy to think we went from this yesterday to this today but we still got the animals to take care of you guys and girls just seem as confused as we do sunny yesterday snow today I don't think they want to come out Sean <laughs> I don't blame them all right let's get these eggs Okay. Looks like we've got two broody hens in the same nesting box. Girls, you can't squidge in there. Come on, I've got to get the eggs. You can always tell that the girls don't like snow because I don't see any of them and they're not shouting this morning. breakfast huh you ready for breakfast you want breakfast under there don't you that's what I thought they braved it but they don't seem too happy about it all right breakfast time girls oh buddy you're just happy to be in the snow You've got Buddy that loves the snow and the goats that hate the snow. <laughs> Alright, that's the girl he's taken care of. And we're actually going to leave them in their pen today. Just because it's so cold and the snow has actually turned to ice. To hail. <laughs> and the girls, because they want to be with us so much, are just hanging out on the porch. And it's so much warmer up here in the shelter and on the hay so they're probably not going to be too happy about it but it's going to keep them warmer last job is just getting more hay for the chickens i noticed they were kind of low in the chicken coop so we're just going to put that in so they're extra toasty today as well 
can see the Mama Ellen is getting hay for the chickens. <laughs> so that they may survive this hazardous winter storm we are currently having. Is this the Shawnee commentary? Maybe, maybe so. <laughs> She's gathering hay with great haste to get it so that she may go inside and warm up. This would be a new game show, how fast can you get hay? <laughs> go, go, gladiators! <laughs> <laughs> Crap, I'm getting snow down my jacket. She collects a bundle of hay. And we're talking about a big bundle. A bundle that may be enough to warm the chicken and up their egg production. Maybe. Happy. I can't. I can't hit record. The cozy Calvary is on its way. I think the chickens will be happy about this. Buddy laid on the guilt trip good enough, so we went ahead and let him come on inside. Look at that. He is as happy as Larry. Oh, you buddy boy. Sleeping on Dad's boots. Oh, are those tasty toes? You like that? Peek-a-boo! So since today is so cold and snowy and icy and everything else out there, I've got my little sidekick here and we've decided to try and do a bit of garden planning. Usually, uh, like last year, when we planted our garden we kind of just winged it really and uh, we thought this year would be a good year to try and get a little bit of planning in even if we don't stick to our plans it helps to have at least a bit of an idea of what we're doing now we wrote a list of stuff that we definitely definitely want to plant this year and uh, we've got tomatoes peppers cucumbers celery green onion, lettuce, green beans and kale. Um, now it's possible we might add to this list but as of right now that's what we're sticking with. And we've also got an idea of how big we want to do our garden this year. We're going to aim for a um, hundred foot long by twenty foot wide. Uh, because the long-term plan is to turn that garden into a greenhouse come the fall and the winter so we can grow some stuff through the winter. So I'm just gonna, uh, I've got my squared paper, all professional, <laughs> um, I'm just gonna try and draw up an idea of what kind of rows we want to plant them in, um, the space between for walkways to make it easier for picking our veggies um, and also what we need to plant down closer to the chicken's pen because that's where oh, it's okay you want to come help yeah but closer to the chicken's pen is what gets full sun and then further away from it doesn't get as much sun throughout the day so we want to make sure we plan according to that as well all right, Ellie. We gonna get this planning done? Yeah, yeah. You gonna help? <laughs> All right, Munchkin. Let's get going.
so I split the garden in half to do 50 foot and then on the other page is the other 50 foot and here's what we've got planned I hope that's focusing all right for y'all and on this page we've got tomatoes peppers okra Lettuce. potatoes cucumbers and we're gonna grow the cucumbers with sunflowers because sunflowers really help the cucumbers um, with the shade and keeping bugs off apparently so we've read and um, green onion and then we've got our gate and our little storage area a storage area right here that's gonna be for the tiller and the hoe and rakes and stuff like that and then here's the key so I remember what's what <laughs> and along the one panel at uh, one side of where we're growing the cucumbers and sunflowers we're going to put a cattle panel here and another one here so that the sunflowers can grow up them and here's the other half um the other 50 foot and it's continuing on with green onion celery lettuce green beans and a whole bunch of kale So that's our plan guys and I know it could change up some but at least we've got an idea of what we want to do and how we want to do it. We'll see how it goes. We need to flash this. Stand still. <laughs> We've got to do the dance, 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 do the dance. something to whack a mama on. No, don't hit me. Okay, so the woman messed up. No I didn't. <laughs> it wasn't um, me because I didn't do it. <laughs> you helped me write the list of veggies out. Um, and carrots was on it. But as I showed you what it's going to look like all together, but right here where we've got the green beans, it's gone. One of them rows is supposed to be carrots. Yeah, so we're going to cancel out a row of green beans. I can't handle sure. 60 foot. Oh. Green beans. Oh, I like eating green beans, but I don't like picking them that much. Sorry, she's yanking on me. But uh, yeah, one of the rows of green beans has got to be carrots. Did you get the okra in here? Yeah, right there. All right, you did. So the only thing I missed was carrots, and like I was saying, this is just a general idea, and I knew we'd end up switching or jiggling things around, but. She messed up. <gasps> yeah. Well, at least we remembered now and not when we were planting. That would have been worse. That's true, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> Plant them all in the ground to figure out now which one of these was supposed to be carrots. <laughs> Look just like green beans. Well, Caitlin will be happy. She loves her carrots, so. And she hates green beans, so we're deleting one and gaining the other. So, yep. so there we go, guys. That's our general plan and Hopefully, it'll be pretty close to when we actually come to planting. Yeah, we're we working hope. on it. <laughs> what you got? Ellie? Are you reading? It's finally stopped snowing. We just got a little bit of rain right now. So Will's just gonna try and get our driveway plowed before it freezes too hard and all turns to ice. So how is it out there, hon? Well, the main road's been plowed. Oh, that's good. They haven't touched our uh, hill over here. No, we're usually one of the last to get plowed. The rain stopped. Well, but I don't see Still it spotting a little bit. <laughs> it's starting to get pretty dark. Yep. We shall see. We'll see. Are you feeling better? Is your medicine working? Good. I thought you was feeling better because you've been a good helper today. <laughs> what? 
I know, you like that buddy boy, don't ya? Tommy! Show Ellie! <laughs> Say bye, Ellie!